Welcome to the Nicholas 11 X12 technology. Today we are looking at the Corsair Builder Series CX500 version 2 budget power supply. On the box it says Corsair Builder Series V2 CX500. This PSU is 80 plus certified, comes with a 3 year warranty and supports the latest standards when it comes to the standby power consumption. On the back of the box you will see the connections this unit actually offers. In the box you get the Corsair warranty guide, security informations, then right here is a plastic bag with 4 black screws and the cable binders. Here's the power cord and lastly the power supply itself. So here's the unit unpackaged. It uses a 120mm fan for cooling and on the side it looks very nice in the case. Mostly you will install it that way. On the back is the on and off switch and lots of room for ventilation. Here's the other side. On the top you will see the specifications. This power supply has a single plus 12 volt drill that offers 34 amps and delivers 408 watts. The plus 3.3 and plus 5 volt drills are for 25 and 20 amps and also deliver 130 watts. Now that the power connections, here's the 20 plus 4 pin power connector, here's the 4 plus 4 pin ATX 12 volt power connector and here are the two separate cables with 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express connections. Then you also get 3 SATA power connectors and lastly another line with 2 more SATA connectors and here are 4 Molex and 1 floppy connector. So once again you get one 20 plus 4 pin power connector, one 4 plus 4 pin ATX 12 volt power connector, two 6 plus 2 pin PCI Express power connectors, four Molex, five SATA and one single floppy connector. Now I'd like to show you the length of the cables. Here's the 24 pin connector, here's the 8 pin ATX 12 volt connector, now your PCI Express connectors, also your SATA connectors and Molex and floppy connectors, last but not least the two more SATA connectors. So there's nothing to complain about length, it should work out great for big tower cases as well. And all of the cables are nylon sleeved by the way. Now to the specifications, the Corsa Builder Series CX500 version 2 delivers 500 watts of power and is 80 plus certified. The 120mm fan will keep everything cool and quiet and active power factor correction is featured as well. An input of 90 to 264 volts is allowed and of course this unit has over voltage, under voltage, over current and short circuit protection. Once again it has a single plus 12 volt drill that has 34 amps on max load and delivers 408 watts. The plus 3.3 and plus 5 5 volt rails have 25 and 20 amps and deliver 130 watts. This power supply will deliver 500 watts at 30 degrees Celsius ambient temperature. So overall great design and build quality. Everything looks perfect for a power supply at this price point. In operation the power supply stays very cool and is very silent as well. Each side of the unit looks very very tidy. The Corsa Builder Series CX500 version 2 power supply is a great choice if you're planning on building a budget build. This isn't meant for a hardcore enthusiast machine. For the price it's definitely a great choice. Pros are good price performance ratio, great design, it's very silent and has long nylon braided cables. For the cons I have one thing to say, there are only 408 watts of power on the plus 12 volt rail. I'd like to see more on this rail but still for the price it's not bad. I give this power supply an 8 out of 10 and definitely recommend it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.